I'm here at five below, you know, and I'm here to get a sugar rush. Feel the rush. And we're going to check out all the cool candies they got because it's ten for a dollar. And that's a pretty sweet deal in my opinion. Can't beat ten cents a pop, so let's see what they got. They got some Jolly Ranchers for a jolly good time. Always love the watermelon. They got some Smarties for all you smarty pantses. It almost looks like Gatorade gum, but unfortunately it's not. It's some Zots, whatever that is. Got some Sour Patch Kids. Got some Atomic Fireballs and Ooga Flames. Looks like the Red Hots. And we got some Cry Babies, Extra Sour, some Lemon Heads. Pretty cool. You get a goodie bag, mix it all up, get all silly with it. Great variety. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Look how big this section is, guys. All the different stuff. We got more stuff over here. Let's see what they got. This is just my little tour, so don't be an airhead because I'm going to razzle-dazzle you with a great variety. Got some air shocks. They got those ice... Remember the icicle slurpy type things they used to have in Kmart? But they got the ice candies. Those even look pretty cool. And decent pricing, anywhere from a dollar to two dollars. Looks like they got a sleepy teddy bear candy. I don't know what's up with that. Uh, they got the warheads. Those were classic. Put them in your head, they explode, go to war. They got the Yoohoo candy bars. Never saw those, but used to love the Yoohoo chocolate and strawberry. There's the Cocoa Pebbles with Fred and Barney having a good time. Good to see them. They got some draft Jelly Belly beer and Duff Simpsons beer. Although I'm sure that they're just sugary drinks. That's interesting. And they got the classic Pez. Super Mario Brothers. I like to see that. They got some Iron Man, Spider-Man. Got some Harry Potter gold coins. Remember Christmas time back in the day, you get the gold coins with the chocolate in them. Those were always a good time. Got some Pater candy and Believe Ted Lasso. Even though he's not a cowboy and doesn't have a lasso. Oh, I like this classic NES controller. And Game Boy candy and Toad candy. And looks like Super Mario Kart candy. Love the Nintendo candy. That looks pretty cool. Just for a couple bucks. And over here, looks like they got the old school candy that no one liked and ate. It always was hard and tasted bad, but they got that too. Oh, uh, here's some good candy. Share a size candy. We got all the different candy bars. The Reese's, Hershey's, Starburst, Kit Kat, York, Patty Whack, Give Your Dog a Bone candy. And some Tootsie Rolls. It's a neat little subsection and more of the vintage 1970s candy that nobody liked. Maybe you do like it. Anyone know the Harry Bow? You know? And we got some Skittles and Sour Punch. And Mike and Ike's. What else do we got? It's always good when it's a payday. Starburst. M&M's. Nerds. This is pretty cool, guys. All the movie theater type candy. The snow caps. The dots. Wow, great variety for a couple bucks. $1.50. And they got the Butterfinger and the Kit Kats. More Warheads, another variety. What was your favorite candy growing up, guys? What did you like? I always liked the Kit Kat, the Butterfinger, the Baby Ruth, and the Twix. I know I said four, but those were my favorite. And there's the Butterfinger and the Baby Ruth and Rocky Road. I always liked those. And we got some mini packs with some of the stuff for buck fifty. Can't beat that. So really impressed with Five Below, guys. This is a nice, cool little sub-sugar rush section with all different varieties of candies and candy bars. Probably way better pricing here than 7-Eleven or Wawa or Cumberland Farms. So what did you like the most here, guys? Anyone come here, what do you get? Let me know in the comments section. Hope you liked my tour. Just wanted to show it off. Pretty impressive. I always like the five below store. Well, now I think it's 10 below or maybe it's 15 below. I don't know. But pretty impressive. Nice job, five below. You know, I'm going to go.